Hello YouTube, in this video, I'm going to be building another gaming computer. Here's a small process of me getting the parts. There it is. The mic was setting. I just got the monitor, now we gotta get the rest of the parts. We got the parts! The parts also fold up. So yeah, pretty cool and interesting. Now you might be asking, why am I building a computer if I already built a computer for myself already? Well, I'm actually building this for my cousin. So yeah, anyways, let's get started on building. Alright, we're gonna start with unboxing the case first. This is the Lancol 205 Mesh C. No. Let's get it back. Here is the PC case. Now, looks really cool. Got two USB A's. I think that's a headphone and microphone jack. Those two here, so I'm a bit confused on what those are. And that looks like a USB C. All right, I'm gonna put this to the side and start with the motherboard. Okay, so I'm gonna start with unboxing uh, Motherboard. It's a Pro B650P Wi Fi Motherboard. Yeah. Let's check it out. We got the IO shoe. I think these are Wi Fi antennas, it looks like. I think this is like an extra cable. I think this might be for like a hard drive. I'm not entirely sure. Let me know in the comments below if you know what it's for. And I think this is for. I think this might be a standoff for the SSD. And there's a quick installation guide. Yeah. Quick installation guide and European Union regulation, regularity notices. Everything back in the box. Now I'm gonna start with the CPU, putting this into the motherboard. So, let's do this.
good. TPU Kampu Daniel just snapped off. I kind of thought he was setting on this very carefully so I don't accidentally ruin the shit. Yeah, got the CPU in. Now, I'm gonna work on the RAM. This is, uh, this is actually the same that I have on my personal computer. And also, once again, the CPU, motherboard, and RAM is in a bundle at Micro Center. I forgot how much it costs. I think it was like around $400 or something. I'll put a screenshot on the screen if I can find it. I don't know if I'm supposed to take the peels off of this, but uh, I'll leave it off. On this road, it's a little bit real because all the slots are black. So I I don't think those are gray slots. So I'm gonna have to look through the user manual to find out where, which one's the best one to put the RAM in. Alright, so after reading the manual, it looks like I have to put in this one and this one. Last time in my last PC build, I made the mistake of putting it in the black slots instead of the gray slots. I think I got the RAM installed successfully now. And now I'm gonna work on the SSD.
Let's do this. This I successfully got the SSD and so I had a little bit of pain because I got confused with the standoffs because they were like connected and so I'm like they're supposed to put them all like this or down your like separate thing and I did have to end up separating them so yeah so we were just messing around and we discovered that this panel is magnetic which is pretty cool yeah now I'm gonna put this back on. This is for the SSD. Let's finish putting all of this. I think it's an SSD thing. Yeah. And now I'm gonna go ahead and put in the mother. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put the motherboard into the case center. I think I finished tightening up the screws, hopefully well, and now I'm gonna work on the CPU cooler. to a time lapse because this is probably going to take a while.
so my phone just died, so I don't know how much uh, the clip we saw. So what basically happened was I'm just installing the CPU pool and I think I also tightened the screw and stuff. So yeah, just gonna finish installing this come to there. And yeah, hopefully it all goes well. This CPU cooler in. Ooh. Hopefully, I can put the glass back on it. Looks pretty <laughs> thick. But yeah, now I gotta plug in the connectors and get the GPU in. Now, unfortunately, right now, I do have to run some errands for my family, so I won't be able to continue this, but, yeah. I'll come back, and you'll see it in the next clip where I'll continue working on this. I'm about, like, 90, 85% done already, so yeah, see you then. Alright, we came back from running errands, and now I'm gonna connect everything up. Hopefully this all goes good. I think I finished everything else, just gotta put the GP in and hope everything else is good. Let's do this. This is an RTX 470 Super by the way, and this is the uh, right version. Let's get this in. Now I'll get the cable. I'm gonna plug this in. Oh wait, I forgot to screw this back on.
Oh, no, I think I just got screwed again. And hopefully, hopefully this will work. Now, we're gonna see if it boots. Oh. Alright, we're gonna test if it boots. I'm gonna open it. I'm going to attempt to boot it up for the first time. Yikes. It doesn't look like it's going to be good. Oh, I see. So, Gladiator, you like it? You like it? Yeah, you like it. Gladiator, wonderful. Very good. It was very strong. It doesn't turn off. And hopefully, hopefully, this will go. 